Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah my dear teachers I am Sajad Akbar Rathar. In this video session we will discuss how to upload the project for Vidya Amrit Mahatso using Diksha platform. My dear teachers first we should have the updated Diksha app in our mobile phone likewise you can see uh, I have opened the Diksha app here. Once I open it here, this is the updated version and you can see here there are so many options. There is the profile button here, the QR code scanner. On the top left corner here, once the three lines here, once I click on these three lines, it will show the options here. Likewise, I have two users in this, rather three users. I have made the Sajad Actu uh, for updating this project on Tiksha platform. So you can see here there is the option coming try new Jumu and Kashmir experience. So my dear teachers we need to click on this so that we can get the course this project option in the Diksha app. Once I click on this you can see here and you will see here the Nishta course is there as most of the teachers have done that course. Likewise there is course digital box but what we need to do is we need to drag down and we need to select here the project so once i select the project before that we, i need to also update my profile here uh, clicking on this uh, below corner right side i click on this uh, you can edit the profile here like the rule is teacher if the uh, hoi want to like submit the project he or she has to click the hdr official now i will click here the student submit likewise you can see the district likewise the block is here the concept of zone cluster and school name and i will click here the submit after that uh, since we are <coughs> back to this main page here i will go down here and i will select here the project just have to wait a bit click on project and this is the project which we have been assigned VAM Vidya Amrit Mahatsav Synopsis VAM underscore JK so this is the project which we have been assigned and to edit this and to modify this synopsis you need to click here on this button and you can see <coughs> the progress since uh, right now we have not done any project not uploaded anything so the progress is zero how to edit this you can see here uh, if you want to edit this you click here the edit button like download share edit files i click on here on the edit button and there is the icon edit icon i click on this and you can edit here likewise but the point to mention is like what you need to edit is you have to start from here this is the opening tag and this is the closing tag so i have to put my name the name of the synopsis in between for example teaching of science using labs so this i did for example this is my synopsis likewise i can edit the objectives what are the objectives uh, i will mention here later on so you need to add here the objective of your project and click save details you can see here that updation teaching of science using computer using virtual labs this has been done now second is here the project name is this duration one month and these are the learning resources uh, learning resources here user guide i have to check this from the other option here you can see here learning resources these are the learning resources i will open this and i will play this this will tell you how to submit the vidya amrit mahatsa project on diksha this is the pure everything is written here so every teacher need to open this read this and these are around 42 pages once it is like done and you can likewise we were doing on the nishta course and once you have done this and click here on the exit button 
likewise i will <laughs> submit this you can see this has been done here now this is the name of the project you have edited and likewise you have to put the objectives here now the concept of tasks click on the task this is mandatory like view learning resources to learn about innovative pedagogy and how to document your project simple in progress view resource innovative pedagogy likewise you have to see this video you already know that so likewise this you have to open this means like this is a task first you need to learn these resources and they are provided by the on the diksha app you need to view this learn the concepts from these resources after that what actions steps took to you solve your challenge you need to add here the details likewise here is add your own task if you need to attach some file here click here on and this is important i will repeat so this is the not if we here in progress okay and you need to attach the files of the project the project of the, it means you have to confirm that the content there is no copyright issue the video should be like uh, minimum 5 minutes up to 50 mb so these are some guidelines of the diksha so you have to accept this and accordingly upload here and you can see you can upload from your library use file use camera to upload any image any video you can do that from this side so once you do this uh, you can uh, click on the add task since uh, i am not doing it right now so this is the option here likewise once you have done this this is tasks this is this then after that you need to submit improvement this can be only this will be actually only once we do these things complete once these things are completed project detail is completed the objectives have been mentioned the tasks have been completed after that you need to submit the submit improvement but the point to mention here is another thing that is you need to synchronize this synchronize means once whatever you have done uh, this will be updated on the diksha app once it will be fully synchronized so once it is done you can see it has been synchronized but if we have uploaded something that will be reflected so these are some options on this uh, how i will repeat i will go back first simple click on the project click here and click edit edit here the title the objectives but keep in mind right in between the braces here opening and closing brace likewise select category is another like what this video is for this is for teachers this is for students this is for community you can check mark this what this project is beneficial for if it is beneficial for these uh, like teacher students you can even school process this is important for this as well so you can check these options you can click on these and put them uh, put them in like check and check whatever you feel this is mandatory just check them and click here submit so it means these the project aim to improve these teacher students community education leader as well as school process that is the project you are uploading this will be beneficial for these uh, teachers students community education leader as well as school process once you click save edit likewise this is about project and in tasks you, <coughs> you need to first view these resources learn the concepts from these after that you need to add your own task the task can be audio video sorry it can be video image or some other file which is related with the project and you click here on the upload once it is uploaded after doing all these things the last thing you need to synchronize and this will be updated on the diksha app so this was all about this video we will come with other videos inshallah in the future thank you thank you very much